The nation's largest 4th of July rodeo celebration returns to Greeley this year. This is a big deal. After a troubled few years because of recession and mismanagement, new leadership has helped the Greeley Stampede hit a high note again. And 7 News reporter Russell Haythorn is live in Greeley right now. Russell, this is a big turnaround. And the stampede has certainly dusted itself off after debt and lean times in recent years. Instead of booking big names in the main arena here like Tim McGraw and Toby Keith, this year's concert lineup includes the likes of White Snake and Kenny Rogers, something many of us can appreciate affordability. And here we go. All right, see how Colton can do. Whoa! Next week, oh, cowboys we and girls coming. ride again in the 93rd annual Greeley Stampede. We're excited. We're eight days out. It's a show that fell on serious tough times in recent years, nearly 228,000 in debt after the 2010 Stampede. Clearly the economy, uh, which was outside of anybody's control. But General Chairman Patty Gates says aspects of the stampede were also mismanaged, primarily booking big name concert acts, charging 90 or more per ticket. We have a lot of competition for folks that have limited dollars. The Met ticket became almost like a 75 to a 90 dollar ticket and up around here it just became too pricey. They were only able to maybe come to that one concert and then they weren't able to come out here and enjoy the other days. Still use the event center for the um, horses and stuff. And then New Stampede right GM here. Justin Watata says this year's concerts will cost a fraction of previous prices. The Stampede did so well after last year, it came out 1.5 million in the black. We've recently created a rainy day fund. So in the case that we do have one or two rainstorms during the event, it's not going to cripple us to where we're not being able to have next year's event. We feel like we've really found a good niche. A niche that serves all crowds, a little bit country, a little bit not. We can provide something for everyone. The boots are optional too. Yeah. Good thing about the boots because I have these things on. They're also providing concert packages this year. $75 for general admission for all five concerts. You can see some of the stampede riders practicing here today on the arena floor. They're hoping for more days like this once the stampede arrives next week with sunny skies. Live in Greeley, Russell Haythorn, 7 News.